Okay, so I guess we're gonna do Re Regine, 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 Regine Velasquez. Yeah. We did one of her videos last time we had Josiah in, and I, I guess she has given me feedback that maybe that wasn't the best video <laughs> to start my Regine Velasquez journey on. So we're gonna see, Some I think more. we have a bunch of stuff today. A few more, yeah. Is there anything else you wanna tell us about? Tell me, <laughs> tell us. Uh, I just wanted to do a little fun fact. You know Brian McKnight? Yes, we oh, love, 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 love. Did you love. Know, like he had a, like one of the biggest crushes on her? Okay, <laughs> well he's got yeah, on Regine. Yeah, yeah. Some, I love him. Yeah, love. So yeah. they never actually dated or anything. I don't. Re I can't recall if they did. I'll fact track that for later. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, okay. Okay. Let's watch. Let's yeah, watch. Yeah. Jay, when is this video from? Eighteen <laughs> forty. <laughs> Probably early. Okay. Okay. You just don't want to miss a thing. Most to you, feeling you happy. Woo, child! <laughs> Wondering what you're dreaming. Wondering if it's me or seeing. Okay, okay. So the last video wasn't the best place to start. No. Mm. Also, Josiah, you don't know, but these eyebrows were the thing. <laughs> oh my god, the thin eyebrows. They were the so thing to have, these <laughs> eyebrows. <laughs> More, a little bit more volume. Sure. I just want to be with you in this moment Okay. Okay. <laughs> I get it. I get it. <laughs> um, what what year would you say this is from? Early, uh, early aughts or nineties? Nineteen nineties. Nineties. I think. I would just comment that the style of singing has really, really changed. I would say that out of curiosity, I don't know if you can answer this. Yeah. In the Philippines, which you weren't born, you were born in Canada. Yes. How prominent is English? Pretty, pr pretty prominent. Do like, most people speak some English? I mean, yes, if you go to the Philippines actually, and you do speak English, they will speak English to you. Mm, well, all the Filipinos I personally know are like, salt of the earth, so kind. So <laughs> kind, so accommodating. Yeah, but I just, I was, the reason I say that is her, her pronunciation is like, I, I listen to people for a living and I'm not sure I would suspect that English is not her first language. Really? Would, would, would you? Uh, She's pre it's pretty authentic English. It is. Uh, but is, sorry, yeah, Tagalog and then you're is Ilocano. 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 Yeah, Ilocano. Ilocano. Yeah. Ilocano. Yeah. Do you think that they make, like is English easy? Like are they similar s sounds, right? Are they similar sounds? I'd say for a majority as like, so taking an example from experience mm -hmm. for my dad, mm -hmm. Um, he grew up in Canada as well, mm -hmm. but the way that he was learning Tagalog uh, or Ilocano was by listening on TV and he said it was kind of like you're sounding out English. So it was kind of easy for him. So it lends itself. I say that because we have, uh, you know, when we, when we review Cantonese or Mandarin or other languages, actually Japanese I feel is less Japanese is easy. It's it's like the syllables are easier it's for. It's more punctuated, more staccato. But the the shapes and sounds themselves are yeah. less challenging than yeah, Mandarin yeah, or yeah, yeah. Cantonese. Um, so do do you do you think she speaks fluent English? If you had to guess. <laughs> totally. Like she. You do. You do. Is perfect. There are some little nuances, like the. Uh, I, oh, I THs? Know. Yes, THs. Yes, THs yes, yes. are across the board. Everybody wants to say the and sa. Yeah. Nobody wants to th. Yes. It's a lot of work to get that tongue. <laughs> Yeah, 
Yes. My... No, I'm still not doing it. Da, 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 da. My... Yes, oh, yes, si yes, similar. Yes. Mine. Yes, yes. Okay, okay. So, so high, but yeah. so good. How's your twang coming? <laughs> it feels like a good time to try it. Uh, it's a like a great time to try oh. it. Mine! Mine! Oh, you can make it a little pointier, but I'm not sad about it. <laughs> That is your voice. It's a real, that's a real thing. Okay. Can you narrow it and say, huh, huh. do you feel that all close in? Huh. Huh. So that's the that's the action. Ah, 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 ah. My, 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 my. Yeah, you're too busy being pretty. Get rid of the pretty. Uh. Be ugly pretty. My, That's better, but we, we gotta get you uglier. Yeah. We gotta get you uglier. Love it. Love lo lo those wide R and B bells. Yeah. Getting up there. Yeah. Nah, we're on an F now. Grit in there? Uh, no, no. Uh, no? Okay. It's just the 1947 recording? Okay. <laughs> you know what I've noticed? Um, you tell me what you've noticed. Okay. Today's vowels, I mean, songs like this don't really exist right now, which... <laughs> I know. Come on. Let me still be not in the grave when this trend <laughs> comes back. But I feel like vowels right now, Beyonce, are like stuff is more influenced by R&B, so vowels are a little rounder and warmer. I was listening to a Beyonce track, and on the word no, I was like, no, and she was like, no, like it's very more, no, it's way rounder. And it reminded me of you, actually, because you listen to R&B in your come up. Yes. So you, if you sang like, because I don't want to miss a thing. In my own Yeah, track. just do you. Because I don't want to miss so it's a lot more thing, thing. So it's a lot more relaxed. Don't. So I'd go don't, don't. Mine would be very bright. You know, don't want to miss a thing. It's everything that sounds like loose and casual. Yes. Ugh. I do try that though, and then the, the difference is so interesting. I think you try what to be like loose and casual. No, I try. To you want to be bright? Yeah, I want to be bright. Why do we always want to be what we're not? <laughs> I'm over here trying to be you. You're over here trying to be me. I just love that. You know why I like it? Because I think it sounds more chill to be, to, to do less with your tongue and less with your cheeks. Don't want to miss a thing. Don't want to miss a thing. Sounds a little bit more chill to me. Yeah. No, I, I actually, I want to pull out like a modern reference. So you guys know Billie Eilish, Birds of a Feather. Yeah. I was singing the song and I was singing it more bright. So it was like, um... Buried and carry had to ride. Is she like, oh, bit so she go buried. Oh, she has to go buried and carry. Buried, buried and carry. carry. And I'm like, I, I sing it buried. But did you can't buried. rhyme with carry? Yeah. But Milena, my sister, pointed out. She's like, that doesn't do rhyme, that. bro. It doesn't. No.
Georgine Velasquez. Okay. If I would have known this, I would have let you read your sheet and do your thing. <laughs> Frankly, I'm gonna be reading my sheet and doing my thing. So, just sorry. She's, no. she's really good. She's good. Yeah, she's she really, really good. Also used to be called like the song, or I don't know, the, uh, the songbird. Yeah, I'm not surprised. Yeah. yeah, beautiful, beautiful. Do we have more? Yeah. Let's go. Okay. <laughs> Hi, Jackie. Yeah, I'm going to go out again. 